We're taking a nice little break. It's so cute here. A little day at the outlets. Are you burping? <laughs> <laughs> Everybody, how you doing? You see the kiddos in the back. It is Saturday, um, Memorial Day weekend, and I am with the kiddos by myself. I'm driving. We're gonna go to the outlets today, which is pretty cool because I haven't gone to the outlets here yet. Um, I was just gonna go to the mall, but then camera back there suggested we go to the outlets, and I was like, you know what? Good idea, Cam. Um, the Hubster is probably still sleeping at this time it's 3 30 p.m are you excited about shopping yeah what do you want to do uh see all the stores i guess all right come on let's go look me and adidas and i'm trying to see if they got some more ivy park i know it's sold out online but this is germany so maybe they have some more they don't i'm still going to the concert though and i'll be vlogging that i won't be showing the concert but i'm gonna be vlogging our experience in frankfurt all right, let's shop. Old school sweatsuit situation. What you thinking, Giselle? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What about you? <laughs> Panther, camera said he don't like it. I'm trying to get him some sneaks. He got his vans on. Trying to find some running shoes. About to go shopping for Dada. He's now gonna be so I excited. He said it was so big. Here we go. You like these, babe? I think this color is really good, good with dark skin. Yeah. It is big out here. We didn't know it was this big. This is nice. Got a little DJ going or some music or something. Time to put some more dents into our checking accounts. What? <laughs> a little bit of drip for the Hupster. We'll show you the haul when we get home. Time for some more shopping. The haul? Uh-huh. I wonder what a haul looks like when dad is doing it. <laughs> so we're walking and stuff, and then what do we see? We see like a whole situation over here. We got a DJ going. Yeah. It's like a little party outside, isn't it? Yes. So we're not just shopping, we're partying. Hold on, I'm going to show y'all. Enjoying your donut? I eat it. Yeah, he just had a face full of chocolate. Cameron still has his chocolate on his face. <laughs> <laughs> she, of course, has the vanilla donuts. We're taking a nice little break. It's so cute here. A little day at the outlets. Are you burping? 
<laughs> hey y'all so we are back at the house and i just want to show you a couple of things that i got today give y'all a little haul situation who doesn't love a haul so we got this pink polo top for matt <coughs> excuse me <laughs> and pink and gray shorts i love him in pink i love a man in pink but especially with his beautiful tan skin and the pink so cute had to get the royal blue and gold situation so love that for him and for me <laughs> so we got that right there such a cute color combo and um, we got this right here light blue and look this man does not if i don't shop for him he won't buy anything he'll go in the store and he he just won't buy anything so the light blue and the pink so kind of opposite because i love pink on him so i don't know how he gonna feel about that but <laughs> i can almost get him to wear anything as, as long as i tell him i think it's cute so we got these for Gigi, and i'm usually not a sneaker girl but i got some for myself i love new balances oh my god when i was in the store i was reminded of high school but we got these for Gigi and they're so cute because even though they lace up, they open with a Velcro, which is so easy for her because she likes to be Miss Independent and open up her own stuff by herself. So we got that for my girlfriend and almost all her clothes are pink anyway. So that'll go with like everything. For me, <laughs> how cute are these? I love them. I love them. When I was in the store, I was like, Sorry, y'all gonna hear the kids. When I was in the store, I was like, I cannot walk away without these. Yes, give them to me. They're so cute. So I got them and I got, I think these are mine too, because I got Cameron two pairs. I didn't get Matt any because I wasn't sure if he liked New Balances. Um, he's a Nikes type of guy. But these are Cameron's, <laughs> literally. He's a tall boy, but these are about, I want to say like a size bigger than his foot. And that's the way he likes it because he loves to run. So these are like, I don't know if they're showing up green, but they're kind of like greenish tan with the blue. And he wanted a brown, but the green can go with brown. Let me see. We did some damage. We did some damage today. So uh, we got these for Levi. When we were in the store, he just kept saying, red shoes, red shoes, red shoes. So, amongst other things, because they were being bad. Hold on, wait. If you don't have your, you should have it. Mm. After a day of shopping, if I was alone, I'd be straight. But with the kids, specifically the littles, we need the wine. So, that is Levi's. And then... These are Camerons. These are Camerons. These are Camerons. So cute. He's going to be tall. I feel like he's going to be at least six months. You know what he said earlier? He was like, I hate being tall. Who thinks he's tall? He don't know that he's going to be in all the ladies because he's tall. And because he's cute. And then, oh my God, doesn't these, these are my zone. Doesn't this take you back? Oh, high school. Philadelphia High School for girls. Right there. Oh my God. Oh, and you can pair it with white, gray, anything. Gray is such a neutral. So those are so cute. Like I want to wear an athleisure fit tomorrow just so I can wear those. Okay, so then I had to buy some more stuff for Matt because he is like, the other day when we were getting ready, he was like, babe, I don't know what to wear. I have nothing. And that's because if you saw on Christmas, I loaded him up on Christmas and then the Christmas the year before, but it's always winter time um when i give him a bunch of clothes so this is a linen lacoste so cute it was literally lacoste and polo at the outlet were about the same price like 85 euro um for a top which i think this is originally 120 so so cute super linen super linen M meaning it's not stretchy and who doesn't eat look i gotta give him a white one because black people like all white parties so um you know he's gonna be my date so if there's an all white party that comes up we got him covered we're just with some khakis so cute so those are his little we just starting them out 
I'm gonna get him some more clothes like that maybe are not super name brand for his complete summer wardrobe. But it's nice to have pieces that you insert in there, right? That's how I feel. Okay, so went to Nike, got myself, that's why I wanna wear an athleisure fit, little bra right there, right? White and black one with the gray sweatpants. So this is so cute, right? It's giving Chanel because of the white and black. I always think of Chanel. Wait, you know what? It's giving Karl Lagerfeld, okay? That's my boo right there. And you'll see why in a second. I have a lot of his stuff, but I love white and black together. Um, so we got that. And then we got Matt some Levi's because he needs some pants. So just some cute khaki shorts, right? And these can actually go with that linen top. Um, and then these can go with like anything and it has right here, you know, the little, little cuts. Cause we got to keep my dude stylish. Now I bought him a 34 and I can't remember if he's a 34 or a 32. And right now that I'm sitting here, I feel like he's a 32. Mm, hopefully he's a 34, but I have the receipt. And you know what the nice part about those outlets is they're literally only 35 minutes from, um, base and like i said they got the dj and two like it was just a vibe being out there on top of that like at the park because there's a park out there you can take the kids right to the park at the outlets and so they can run around when they get too worked up which we plan to do but Gigi threw up while she was eating dozen donuts so the most important part i love paul i was so happy that they chose him for this year's met gala um, to be recognized and they were selling his stuff at the BX and I was like that's gonna stop once once this Met Gala gets up because Anna Wintour said that Carl is in and you know she's the Devil Wears Prada and so now no more selling it at the BX just like I thought but look I love a classic situation I love a collect I didn't even notice that I love a classic situation. Yes, that's all, that's it. I have two polo purses that my Aunt Judy gave me, a red one and a green one, similar size, so cute. I like grown ass women purses, okay? I don't want no little kid purse. I mean, I'll take a, a clutch or something like that, but you know these little purses that they're making, the miniature purses that look like big purses? No, I'm a grown ass woman. Give me a clutch or a big purse and I'll do a shoulder bag, that's it. So classic Ooh, little dust bag up in there uh and the pattern i don't know i don't think i ever told you guys this because i don't talk much about fashion on here but my favorite um, bag is a dooney and burke and they do the pebbling all the time and i just love that because i like when it gets worn in i feel like it's something about that pebbling when it gets worn in it has a worn in look but never an old look and carl's bags last forever I have a couple of them now. So, you know, I had to go in and get me a wallet because I got my wallet from Shein. I ain't even gonna lie. And I got it twice because I love it so much. Um, but it's time. It's time to be a big girl and get a big girl wallet. I have a couple of big girl wallets, but they're too long. Um, and sometimes I need something small to fit in my clutch if I go out with the Huffster. So this is so cute. In Germany, you guys, you need a compartment for change because they have one euro and two euro and everything in between um, lesser than um, in change. Unlike America, we only have dollar for dollar. Um, and we don't, we don't really sell $2 bills, but, or have $2 bills, but Germany does. So you need your change, especially when you go to park, you need this or go to the bathroom because it costs money. Okay. Um, so this is so cute. I'm so glad I had this. Oh, it smells so good. It smells like leather. Um, and I just got some socks because in my athleisure, I love wearing my tube socks rolled up nice and high. I think it's so cute. Um, even when I have like, um, what do I want to say? Those like tights, but like jeg jeggings or short tights. When I have short tights on for the summer, I still like having my tube socks. And then I got this cute shirt and it's a crop situation. And I have 
a black and white bag by him already. So this will go cute with that. Just a little crop. And these run really big. I'm usually a medium to a large in shirts, and this is a small. So, um, and what else? Oh, I forgot about this girl, guy, whoever is watching this. Um, okay. Okay. You know I love a fanny pack. I don't know if you know, but I love a fanny pack situation with the top and the tights and the fanny pack hanging off just a little bit and the sneaks or some shoes if you go on a brunch. Girl, bye. Okay, so that's cute. And then last but not least, I got it in beige too. It was so nice, I had to buy it twice. So the beige is gonna go so cute with that pebble top, pebble top, pebble purse. And it says Carl Lagerfeld. Lagerfeld. When I was younger, we all used to wear Carl Kanai. So this is so cute that it, I think that's another reason that I'm drawn to it. So anyways, that is my haul. I think I got everything we were carrying. Look at this big ass bag. They were so sweet. Let me just tell you something about the Carl Lagerfeld store. Go there at the outlet, go. I can't say much for the Levi store. They were not sweet, but, oh, even a little, um, while it came with a duster. <laughs> what are you going to need a duster for? You're going to use your wallet, but. All right, well, we have a day pack tomorrow. I got to do the commissary because I'm Sunday grocery shopping, and y'all all know, and if you don't and you're coming here, that um, everything in Germany besides, like, um, places to eat and maybe a couple of things for the kids and parks or something like that is closed so like shops are all closed so Sunday shopping for groceries will be at the commissary going to go to brunch and then I think I'm gonna take the kids to the park and if I don't take them to the park tomorrow I'm gonna take them to the park <coughs> on Monday because your boy is working tomorrow and it's nice to have him helping me so that one when one is going one way and one is going the other way I have help so um I am going to cuddle in with my wine And watch some crazy tv i'll see y'all tomorrow hey guys it's us again it is monday and thankfully places to eat are still open even though it's labor day for germany too even though it's our memorial day we're going to eat right now at big emma's they have huge portions i thought i was just going to be going alone but look who's coming with me you got anything to say to the people uh it's memorial day um and i'm awake a good thing <laughs> this night shifter woke up to spend time with us so come along with us So look, I was like, can you give me the biggest glass of wine? Cause you know how sometimes they'll pour you like a half pour of wine and then sometimes they'll pour you like a full glass. And I was like, the biggest glass you have. And she was like, that's a liter. That's a big boy. <laughs> and then I looked at Matt and he was like, yeah, that's more than a bottle. And I was like, yeah, just, just a normal glass. So <laughs> big Emma's comes through. If you're, if you're trying to get lit on a Monday, then that's perfect, but this is a perfect size. These are huge. This is a kid size. It will be an adult size at another restaurant. This is huge. For reference, look at my wine glass, which is a normal size wine glass, compared to this. Right? And then we got this right here, huge again. Look at his beer, normal size beer compared to this. <laughs> Babe, what'd you get? 
It's called a uh, Schweinhaxe, and uh, it's my favorite German dish that I found so far. Um, I got it at Oktoberfest in uh, Stuttgart last year. Uh huh. So. Fellas trip. I been, wasn't invited. I was. I've been looking for it, <laughs> and they got it here, so I'm pretty excited. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so we got out the car and Seawalk was a bust. You guys saw a little around. It's a lot of people there, which is cute. It's nice. I would say if it was just Gigi and Levi, we would have stayed because they can play on that little park. But Cameron likes the super big slides and all the stuff that there is to do at Dino Park. You would agree? Yeah, it was for the size of the park. It was just pretty crowded. Really crowded. So like maybe on a day... Less after crowded. school because more people aren't going to go out on a weekday um to a park but and plus i think it's free so dino park you have to pay and this park is free sorry if you guys heard the air conditioner dino park you have to pay and this park is free so that's why but um we are on our way to dino park it is about to be five o'clock so they'll have two solid hours of play they're still going to have a tantrum when it's time in the car even if they had four hours of play so um Come, come along with us. Maybe you'll see something at Dino Park you didn't see before, but we are having a good day and I can't wait to get a beer. Okay. It's so crowded today. In the yeah. camp? Yeah, it's very crowded. We're excited about the crowd though. So happy that we're at Dino Park. And when we came in, we asked about the season pass. It is $49 for two adults and all kids under the age of 18. And that season pass goes from April to October. So the next time I come here, I'll definitely be picking up a season pass. Cause what baby, after five. after five, cause today it was what, 13? Yeah. After five times here, it'll pay for itself. And they love the park. So she's, she's already shouting dinosaur, but more clips of the kids coming up. This is Cameron, and he's about to do the tightrope challenge. <laughs> that was one one step. Are you I serious? Ready. I was focusing on you. I wasn't focusing on the ground. All right, for reals. 